Hello guys, welcome back. Minecraft with Dummies here. Today I've got something awesome to show you and it is a fully tileable T flip flop that is silent. Now this has never been done before and it is actually smaller than a regular T flip flop which is all loud and has two pistons in usually. And so this actually is just brilliant. Now, if I hop around the side you can see that this is just absolutely tiny and when I flick the button you'll see what happens. And basically what happens is when you press the button it sends a pulse out for 10 ticks which unlocks both of these hoppers for that 10 ticks and in this time it can let three items through so it will go from here it will go one two three so it will now be in this position which means it will have um, changed state so there you go and if I do it again it will go three again from in here so it will go one two three and it will be back on again so if you are using this for an actual T flip flop you can take the outputs out from the front or the back as you can see so if I just get a block and put it on here and then get the comparator you can see that it will currently be on in this state and you can see it a little bit better if I press it now see that is the only problem with this design is that it actually gives another pulse each time so as you can see when it's turning on it will actually give two pulses to both of these which can be annoying but other than that it is absolutely brilliant so as you can see this is one brilliant use for it just having it as a little selector array so you can just put these directly next to each other and have them all turn off and on so as you can see they're also instant on however they do take a little bit to turn off but that's obviously expected now if the designs I've just shown you don't quite tickle your fancy I actually have an alternative that where the button is on the lamp this one is not tileable However, it is actually much smaller. And if you just look at this, this thing's tiny, and again, it is silent. It uses the same principles, except it uses redstone, which just makes it a lot more compact, but again, it makes it non tileable So yeah, this works in exactly the same manner. It just switches between them three times, giving an output at the end of it. And like the other designs, all you need to do is just put one item in, and it will do the rest for you. And as the same as the other design as well, you can take an output from the other end. So if I just put a block down here, then I can also take the output from over here, obviously in the opposite state. Now, if you can't already tell how to build it from just looking at it from this side, I will show you now. So it's just a block here, and then you want to put your repeater on here. You want to have your input going into that repeater. Now this goes into a block. And so when this is powered, it will turn both torches off and this will um, take away power from both of the hoppers and you want the hoppers facing into each other so for example if I put in a button now and if I turned off both these torches the item will just flicker between these and it can go as I said three times um, it can move three times once you press the button now that is actually the whole thing all you need to do is take the output from it now and if you want a lamp um, like a little uh, array thing like I've done over here you just put a block here with a lamp underneath it and if you wanted to just use it as a general T flip flop, you can also take the output from the back. However, obviously it will be the opposite to the one at the front. So yeah, it is really that simple guys. And these are fully tileable as I said, placed directly next to each other and completely silent other than obviously the button pressing, which you can't really avoid. But that is all there is for today guys, and I hope to see you next time. <laughs>